Hello guys, welcome back to another tutorial. Today is the long-awaited episode 11 of the roll of the RNG series. Sorry. In today's episode, we're going to make game passes and a shop. Very easy, very straightforward. With that being said, please consider subscribing, joining my Roblox group down in the description as well as the Discord, and let's jump straight into it. So, first of all, we need to make a game pass. So if you go over to Roblox or inside of Roblox Studio, you can get this. And this is my game currently that I am making uh, my game on. So go to your game. Uh, let me see, let me see. Uh, press on manage experience. When we press manage, manage, okay, never mind. <laughs> go to passes. Here I already have some because this is my place where people can donate. This is no sponsor or anything, so don't get that in your mind. Just create a new pass. Um, I will be named this to outer roll, for example. You can make this with the quick roll as well. So, uh, outer roll, and you can change the icon, you can change the description if you want. Then, when you created it, uh, Press on these three dots on your new pass. Uh, press on open in new tab. Then you can go ahead and configure. You can set the sales to whatever Robux you want. You can set it to 200. You can set it to 6,000. Probably not so many people will buy it if you set this too high. Set it to a good price. And yeah, so you will get. 70% because Roblox will take 30 of them. So, for example, if I make if I say 10, you will get 7. So, I'm just going to say uh, 1, or I can say 2, because I'm going to test this in a real game so you can see that it works. So, if you go ahead and refresh now, you got the outro on here. If you open up it in a new tab, make sure to delete it from your inventory so you can test it out. Press up here, this is the ID, copy this ID, go inside of Roblox Studio. Um, you can just make, uh, you can make a decal and just set the texture to this number. Uh, there you have your ID, just copy it somewhere, you can paste it in Discord, just remember it. Uh, so, if we now want to apply this to our outro, we can go inside of the rolling script here and we can go down to the outer roll here and here we can say if not and first of all we need to define yeah here you need to define the marketplace service i already did that so local marketplace service equals game get service marketplace service so uh, if not marketplace service user owns game pass async and inside of here, they want the user ID, so the user ID of the player, which is player's user ID, and the ID, the game pass ID, which is, this is mine. So, the one you copied, paste it inside of here. If they do not own it, then we are going to prompt game pass purchase, a pass for the player, and the ID as well. Uh, else we're going to or we're going to return after and we're going to say else else we're going to do this and uh, because i already tested it i added a end down here so it shall look like this for you make sure to type end down here and the end you got up here because when you're saying this you will get the end so it will look it will look like this uh, I will redo this just for you. So mark the service. We got prompt it, prompt it player and the ID. Here we go. Uh, and we're going to return. If we look something like this, this end, press Control X, go down, copy it here. Uh, now we got a error though for some reason uh, because we need to say else. There we go. So it can look like this. If I will go ahead and play now, you won't see that this is 
totally working. Um, well, if I go ahead now and then press on the out roll, you get prompt with this. If I go ahead and buy your game, you will not be able to use the out roll. It will just be prompting it again because it is a test purchase and it is not. Um, it is not exactly it does not work in studio sorry so for example if i would go ahead and go inside of my game instead so i can go to places uh, in mind i can go here and go to view on roblox if i go ahead and first of all i need to publish the game so publish roblox uh, then go inside of here shut down all servers migrate to latest update if i go ahead and join the game now uh, okay great so now i'm in the game if i go ahead and press on outro now and uh, if you buy this in game your robux will be drawn so make sure you have some robux or something or just make the game pass to one or zero and test it out so if i purchase this now your purchase of outro succeeded if i press on outro uh, it does work it's just a bit laggy because my computer is uh, very slow but it is working great uh, if I go ahead and rejoin the game now, I shall still have the pass. Uh, if I go ahead and go to store, you can see how I got my outro. I got it on. And if I go ahead and go inside of the game, and I press on outro, it does work. Because we have the game pass. Great. Now I will show you how to make a shop with this. You can make the exact same thing with the quick roll so here just copy what we did uh, down here copy this paste it uh, here again and of course you need to make uh, uh, else we're going to paste this inside there like this Make sure that you have your new if you make for example a quick roll and make sure that the quick roll id is placed inside of here and not the out roll id then this will work the same way so uh, uh, let me redo this great so if we go i will just make a very very simple uh, shop you can customize this i will make it very very simple uh, I go ahead and scale it. I go ahead and just make this a little bit bigger. Something like this. Like I said, very, very simple. Inside of this frame, we are going to add a text button. We're going to make the big background color a bit gray. I'm just making it very simple because I want uh, to show you how to script a inventory like this uh, you can make the ui much better than this this can be out roll this can be um quick roll so i did not scale it but uh fuck that uh, or i did not set the anchor point uh, but like i said you can make your ui much better than this so if I go ahead, I can make a script up here. I can call this game pass handler or store handler or something like that. And I say local frame is equal to uh, script of parent. No, yes, script of parent of frame and the local auto roll equals frame dot auto roll and local quick roll equals frame dot quick roll. Frame quick roll. There we go. Now I can say outer roll dot mouse button one click. Oh mouse button one click connect function and inside of here I can basically just 
kit. Yeah, exactly like it says, says here. The game get service, uh, marketplace service, make this a variable local marketplace service. Here we go. And now I can say marketplace service uh, user can first of all see if uh, if marketplace use game service player dot we need to define the player as well local player equals game dot players dot local player I'm going to pass through the player dot user ID I'm going to pass through my ID uh, here we go then we are just going to return else we are going to uh, say marketplace service prompt game pass purchase player uh, and this id if they already buff you can just say that uh, it shall say something like okay great oh like you can see my internet is completely uh, usable um, yeah if this didn't save i'm going to okay it didn't hmm. okay Oof. i know this video was a bit messy uh, if you did not understood what happened please uh, ask in the discord else just copy what i did in the video and everything will work perfectly fine and for example if you want it to prompt the inventory instead instead uh, whenever you press on the outro button you maybe want the inventory to show uh, if you want that just go inside of the uh, rolling client here again and here we can just say if if we define our if we make a very fast ui again call it shop Instead of here, we add a frame, set the shop enable to false, and I go ahead and define local shop equals crypto parent dot parent dot shop. Dot, yeah, dot shop. There we go. If I go down here, I can just say shop shop dot uh, enable equals true, and if I do not own this pass now, the shop will. Uh, be shown it's that simple so hopefully you understood this video uh, else please contact me uh, and i see you in the next video which will be about luck uh, which i know that you guys have been waiting for a long time take care you guys and i see you in the next video goodbye